Hey guys, welcome back to our channel. So right now, we are headed to Petco. What else are we gonna do, babe? I don't know, I'm thinking about we'll probably buying a pressure washer. So, that way you can finally do our backyard and get it cleaned up. It's all dirty. Because yeah. last week we started cleaning up and then Joel had the excuse that he got a cut on his foot so he couldn't continue cleaning the backyard. <laughs> ah, and the dog's nose are really long so we're going to flip its nose. Penny! She's going to be a penny. Dude. Penny! She's going to be the dog's name. I wonder if we should trim her eyes. Guys, how old does a dog have to be uh, until you start uh, when you can start putting it in the back of the truck? Or, or can you do that? Is that illegal? I don't think you can put the dog in the back. You can probably fly out on I think it needs to like get a trim around its eyes because its hairs are getting really long. All of that trim her hair. That it can't really see. You excited, are you? Hi, she hi. No. Okay, no. Alrighty, Penny, are you ready to go clip your nails? I'm ready. Lock the truck, babe. Let's go cut Penny's nails and her hair. Yeah. Let's go, okay. Let's go Penny. Where is she? You want a mouse? Look, Aria. You want one of those? Get a mouse, or is that nasty? That's nasty. Mm -hmm. Look, Aria, you want a fish? A fish. Oh, wow, look at the fish. Oh, it's fish. Ah. Huh? Oh, a scoop? Huh? Nasty. In the room? Nasty. Oh, what is it called? Oh, to put uh, cat litter? You want to put cat litter in the little thing? Little, you know, I want a box for the dog. So it can poop in there. <laughs> You're going to clean that up or what? Why don't you just let it poop outside? What do you want to see? <laughs> Are you trying to show your BBL or what? <laughs> Alright guys, so that was an epic fail. They couldn't cut the dog's nails because our dog is way too hyper. So they said that we need to get it trained. <laughs> <laughs> Just uh, another thing so they can try to charge us more. Now we have to get it trained before it can come cut its nails. But you know what? Maybe at the vet they'll probably do it. Or do you think they'll say the same thing? Or what? This is, I just feel like uh, to train a dog you literally gotta... It's, you, you know, you just don't take it to one training session and it's done. Oh no, it has six weeks. Six weeks, but once a week or? Probably, yeah. So six times, so? Yeah. I don't know. Yeah, so we'll see. And how long they are have... you going to spend training? Though? We'll look at the paperwork they gave us, the thing that uh, that they train dogs or whatever. I showed the dog how to sit like in a day. <laughs> it's not about just sitting, it's about behaving. Hey, we need to get a treat, huh? Yeah. But um, I feel like it is a good thing to get it trained because it jumps on people and I feel like uh, it needs to learn not to be jumping on people because it like always wants to be jumping on people. And Ari is sad because I didn't let her drink my Red Bull. Oh, you're fine. Good job, Princess. We'll get you something to drink, okay? Alrighty, guys. So, next stop is Lowe's. We brought Penny to come on a walk to the park before we go to Lowe's. Alright guys, so we have made it to Lowe's. Is it weird that I'm a girl and I like coming to Lowe's? Well, you know, we're spontaneous guys, so we're probably going to make some carne asada tonight. <laughs> <laughs> so we're looking at the girls, we're thinking if we should get a grill now or wait till it starts getting warm out. That's nice. Yeah, that's really nice. But Look, you do know you have to clean these, right? So you can stay nice. Oh well. Tell that to yourself. <laughs> uh, look at this one. This one's only 
$2.99 for this one and it's really nice and big. I don't know what the difference is. That's hella nice. But I don't get how like, this one's $300 and the one over there is uh, $5.29. We'll the, show them the first one. Oh yeah. It looks the same. It's probably not about the looks, it's probably about what it can do. Oh no. It's a little bomb. The Amazon got my own. It's like that. Sheesh. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Joel wants to get a pressure washer so we can start washing our cars and washing um, the the patio because it's really dirty. Let's see. Oh, look, I want to buy um, chairs at a table. What do you so want to buy? I'm guessing it's on special or. Oh, no, the bottom was 250 I don't know. So we're gonna look at what we're gonna get and then we'll go ahead and update you guys on what we get. So for sure we want to get the pressure washer, maybe a grill. And what was the other thing that we came to look at? Uh, look at that handsome face. <laughs> uh, that's it or no? Mommy! I think I think there's something else I want to look at um, first of all. What? Oh my goodness, oh my goodness, so beautiful. Uh -huh. All right, guys. So today we're gonna to be reviewing the Craftsman vacuum and the Craftsman uh, pressure washer. All righty. So we so we ended up getting things to clean our car, and we didn't end up getting a what's it called? Uh, oh, what is it called? What didn't we get? We didn't get the. Oh, we didn't end up getting the grill because Joel's little elbow started hurting. It was really hard to uh, decide decide on, on, on these because we never owned one before. Uh, it's uh, 1900 uh, PSI and we didn't know that's good enough to wash a car, but I think it is because I guess if you go over 2000, that's too much pressure for the car. So, so we're going to start off with the 1900. We're going to review it for you guys, see what you guys think about it. And then we got these little ropes, we found them um, so we can start exercising and hopefully right now once we're done cleaning the cars we can build so build andre's basketball cord <laughs> cord or what is it called oh basketball hoop yeah hopefully we can start his basketball hoop and surprise him with it oh Shows on, it shows let's on the see. picture that it should have one. So let's see what comes included. So the price on this guy's was $149.99. The, the 2300 PSI. What's what? the 23 or 22? That one was $200. And then there was one that was 1700 PSI for $99.99. Okay, boring. Uh, we, went, we, went in the, <laughs> we went with the one in the middle uh, just in case. Because we also want to wash our floor, our garage floor. Oh, yeah, you can look. See it's kind of dirty. Kind of, it's super dirty. So, let's see what comes inside this box. So, you open up the box. We got. Oh, please don't tell me I'm going to have to build something. This guy doesn't like building anything at all. All right, I'm going to start vacuuming my car. I'll see you guys in a little bit. No, well, I need to show them what's in here. Oh, sorry. It looks really dark. Can you stand on this side? Because. I can't even see you. Okay, so we got clean tool. We got it. A pressure washer. Okay, so I don't know what this is for. We're gonna have to figure it out right now. But we're gonna put it together. Right now. Yeah, yeah, you're gonna put it together. Aria, come on, baby. This we're gonna put it on. Do you need my Bob the Builder skills to come in handy and help you out? What? I think put the wheels on it too. This guy. That sucks. I didn't want to build that again. I should have got the little $100 one that you just really take out of the box. It's nice. It's nice, princess. It's nice. Mommy. 
Okay, baby. Nice. Oh, wow, that's nice. Okay, well, I'll be back when I put it together. <laughs> figure it out. That's cute. Mm -hmm. His three little parts and he's complaining. You think he's going to put a basketball court together when it has a thousand pieces? Yeah, obviously not. You can put it together. <laughs> Look how much little pieces are in it. So it's all these, all these little pieces, that who knows how they go, that bar right there, and there's a big mess, there's like stuff on top of it, and then there's like still all these pieces. Do you guys really think he's gonna put that together? Obviously not. Poor Andre will, won't have a basketball court for the next five years. By then, he won't even want to be playing basketball. <laughs> yeah. oh, he's already all stressed out. It was actually pretty easy to assemble. So uh, this is a the handle that was uh, came separate. So he just goes in here. You don't have to screw them on. This right here is the only thing you had to screw. <laughs> This right here is the only thing you have to screw. It comes with four screws. So you just screw it here. Here. You can use a power tool or you can use a screwdriver, it doesn't matter. And this this little piece right here holds a gun. So that's pretty much all I did. This other piece came separate, you just put it in there. But yeah, that's it. It's not really that hard to assemble. Alrighty guys, it's pretty dark outside, but we almost have the basketball court all done. My baby's putting in over time to get Andre's basketball court done. How tight does that have to be, babe? Does that have to be pretty tight? I don't think so. All right, Andre, are you pretty excited? Yeah. The net is going up already. Sheesh. All right, babe, here. Do the honors. You want to put on the net, Andre? And, and it is all done. Here. How many months is it? Three months later? <laughs> December. <laughs> January, February, oh, March. You're the best of all, Come on, this way you don't know how to put on the net. You're the best of all, Ah, Okay, we'll show you guys once it's on already. Are you excited about Andre's basketball court, JJ? Yeah. It looks nice, huh? Yeah. You guys can play too. How do you feel, basketball player? So that's what it's looking like. It can go really tall, so that's why we like it. That's as short as it goes, but it goes really, really high up. We'll show you guys uh, tomorrow in the daytime because it's pretty dark already. <laughs> 